Hey guys, it's Anya. Welcome back to my channel. I am on this video because I'm taking it. <laughs> anyway, um, I have a haul to share with you. And if you want to see what I got from Lavender and Speckles, just keep watching. Okay, you guys. So this is my very first purchase from Beth, um, who is the owner of Lavender and Speckles. And I purchased two of the samplers. One, I had to see what versions of these that I liked. So I got the pretzel sampler and I got the strawberry pound cake sampler and these are, <laughs> these are so freaking cute. I love these like mesh bags. Um, so price point, uh, the strawberry pound cake sampler was $28.50 and the pretzel sampler was $31.50 which brought my whole order to $60. Bucks. Um, Yes, so yes, it's less than 100, but I ordered these back in July on the 29th. Um, so I am excited because I've never, I've never purchased my own <laughs> lavender speckles. I did just recently try a blend that I received from Summer, and it was the uh, toasted lavender mallows. Oh no, toasted lavender marshmallows and Palo Santo. It was so beautiful, so beautiful. Um, I warmed half a bunt shape in my nighttime warmer next to my bed and it was still going in the morning. It was so pretty. Um, so I'm very excited about these bakery blends that I got. <laughs> next time if she offers Apollo sampler or uh, bigger options, um, versus a sampler size, then I will most likely be purchasing a few items. Okay, so let me just get into the goodies. This is the thank you card. And I love, I love that when she, when she personalizes it, I think that's a great touch. And the warm dates uh, can be found on my invoice, which I found and it says that I can warm all after 9.16 which is fantastic and then this is her business card Beth Wilson and those are her chickens <laughs> oh I can't wait to be at the point in my life where I can have chickens I want chickens or eggs and they come in all different varieties um so there's ones I can't remember what they're called, but they have feathers on their feet. They look like they're wearing little, like those uh, Marilyn Monroe house slippers with like the feathers on them. So freaking cute. I think featherlings. Anyway, I digress. Here I am three minutes and I haven't even opened anything. So these just came today. So I'm going to start with the strawberry pound cake sampler. And these are my first sniffs also. So we have uh, strawberry fluff bread, which is strawberry pound cake, fluffy marshmallows, and zucchini bread. I may, I may do this in two parts. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do this in two parts. So this, right now, what we'll do is the strawberry um, pound cake. Oh, yum. Oh, that is so good. That is a great combination. Oh, and look at the shape. You can't. Oh, yes, you can. No. Nope. Focus. Because I suck at this. Yeah, that's so good. Strawberry pound cake. I can't wait to see if I can. I think there's one in here with just strawberry. Her strawberry pound cake, by itself. Let's see how that is. Ooh, this is gonna be good. Strawberry Halloween treats, which is strawberry pound cake blended with pumpkin pecan waffles, caramel swirl, and sweet candy corn. I am currently obsessed with candy corn scents. I think it's a fantastic note in wax. Oh, 
Oh, that is so good. Oh. I'm picking up all of the notes. All of it. Yum. You know what else I love is that these sizes, I know a lot of people will pop a whole one in the warmer. I'm stingy, so I'm gonna cut these in half so I can do my whole living room. <laughs> yes, I'm stingy with my wax. Oh, strawberry lemon zest pie. Strawberry pound cake with some extra lemon zest blended with pie crust and vanilla waffle cones. Love these labels. Okay, my fingers and nails are not working. Here we go. Oh, that is so good. Yeah, it's beautiful. I'm actually getting the strawberry pound cake and lemon zest and then like the like the cookie baked nuts from the waffle cone and the pie crust. Yes, ma'am. Oh, oh my goodness. I wonder Beth, if you get to watch this, if you get to watch this, if I come across your feed on YouTube, um, when do you feel like strawberries are seasonally appropriate? Would you like have this offered in the early spring, say like March or April or uh, summertime? Because I would be down with a whole lot of these. Okay, next up is strawberry vanilla fudge cookie cake. Oh, shut up, I love butter vanilla fudge. Okay. Strawberry pound cake, vanilla butter fudge, sugar strawberry cookies, and white cake. For me, strawberry bakery is year round, but I mean, I understand having, wanting to do it seasonally. Oh, this is so good. Yeah, that is decadent. <sighs> decadent. Yeah, I like the strawberry cookies. Oh, guys, this is fantastic. Yep, okay, that's... So far, I haven't come across one that's not a favorite. This is amazing. Oh, this one's gonna be good. Carnival Ride. Strawberry pound cake, juicy apples, maple bourbon, and cotton candy. Yes, okay, so I'm getting the apple in the cotton candy. Oh, and that maple bourbon just adds like a sophisticated note. Oh, that is great. And that strawberry pound cake really like creams, creams it out. I love this. Okay, next up is very, very cornbread. Which is strawberry pound cake, blueberry muffins, and sweet raspberry punch blended with honey cornbread. Oh, my fingers are not working. Here we go. So the first thing I'm getting is the raspberry. Why does raspberry act like that? Yeah, all I'm getting is a raspberry punch and like a bready note from the cornbread, but I I will be interested to see how these warm. So you know cornbread's gonna come out while it's um, warming. That is so cute. A little rose shape. I love these. Okay, next up. Cotton candy frosting birthday cake. Sign me up. <laughs> Strawberry pound cake, can cotton candy frosting, vanilla bean Noel, and of course birthday cake. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is so good. I get the cotton candy frosting and the vanilla. With the bakery, of course, the birthday cake and the uh, strawberry pound cake. It's not like a super potent strawberry pound cake, but it, ugh, you guys, strawberry pound cake's main notes to me, in my nose, 
are mostly like the whipped cream with like a subtlety of the pound cake and then a hint of strawberry, like slices of strawberry hidden between mountains of pound cake and um, whipped cream. <laughs> but it's still good. Oh, this is gonna be yummy too. Okay, strawberry glazed donuts, strawberry pound cake, uh, creamy vanilla, sugared waffle cones, and glazed donuts. Oh, that is amazing. Yeah, this smells like, like a jelly filled donut. But then you have like the glaze on top. Yeah, that's so good. And that waffle cone. Waffle cone to me always has like a little, just a touch, teeny tiny, like literally just a touch of spice. That is amazing. Oh, this one's gonna be good too. Um, strawberry cinnamon buns. Strawberry pound cake with sweet cinnamon buns blended with frosted sugar cookies. Yes and yes. Ah, what a great, what a great job. <laughs> These are very cute. My fingers are not working and the bags are still warm. I should have waited, but you know me, I'm, I jumped the gun. <sighs> yes. I can actually smell the frosting in this with the sugar cookie. I like... I love this. The cinnamon buns with the cookie, uh, sugar cookie note, that is great because it kind of cuts through the cinnamon notes in like the cinnamon roll. That is so good. This one's gonna be good too. Loopy strawberries, which is strawberry pound cake blended with Fruit Loops with a touch of green apple. I can already smell it through the bag. Fruit Loops is a very like potent oil, apparently. Oh, but I love this with the apple. Yeah, that is so good. That is definitely a bright and cherry scent right there. Yeah, I get the Fruit Loops and the apple. That is beautiful. And these are the two that I was looking forward to the most. Okay. Strawberry pound cake and Palo Santo. Focus. Okay. Yep. Oh, <laughs> that is a beautiful Palo. Oh, this is... Oh. What a great combination, strawberry pound cake and Palo Santo. If you haven't tried Palo Santo blends with a creamy baked uh, bakery scent, you're missing out. It, it just elevates the scent so much. And I am late to the Palo Santo game. I'm late to vendor wax period, but this is a fantastic blend. Okay, and then we have the original strawberry pound cake, which is sweet strawberries, lemon zest, fluffy pound cake, and vanilla. You know what's funny is I'm one of those people, while well, I struggled to open this bag, I'm one of those people that want to get strawberry pound cake versions from all the vendors and just have a giant stash of all the strawberry bakery. I love this. I can actually smell the lemon zest. Yeah, that is amazing. I'm going to need this in truckloads. That is so good. Oh, yes. Now that I know what the original smells like, I will definitely be able to pick it out amongst the other scents. Okay, we're going to put the Palo one on top. <laughs> Just because. Okay. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Make 
strawberry pound cake just adds something to blends and I am so here for it. All right, you guys, that was my strawberry pound cake sampler. Thank you so much for joining me on this unboxing video. Stay tuned for part two where I go over my pretzel sampler, which I'm super excited about. Thank you so much. You guys have a fantastic day and take care.